Snow fences are a valuable tool in winter travel safety, but they're only useful during snowy months. YDOT is currently involved in a pilot project to explore a way to get year-round value from these iconic structures. Between Laramie and Cheyenne on Interstate 80 is a segment of snow fence featuring a new concept and design. So it's uh, going to do two things. It's going to work as a snow fence and then also as a solar collector. The inventor and designer of the solar snow fence recently received a federal grant for a pilot project to study the dual-use fixture. So they approached YDOT because they know we need snow fences and we just said we would be able to find a location and we have one here on I-80 where we know we've got plenty of wind, we got plenty of snow, and we're gonna give this a good test. With photovoltaic panels in place of wood slats, the device will pivot to track the sun, but lock into place when needed for use as a snow fence. This is just another evolution in using different materials in which we can accomplish the same goal of being able to prevent snow from getting onto our roadways and prevent crashes. The pilot study will last 18 months. In the future, these panels could power remote roadside instrumentation and even feed into the power grid. For now, Whiteout wants to ensure the design is effective in collecting blowing snow. Remember, when there's ice and snow, take it slow and always buckle up. This is Doug McGee reporting.